To the channel today we have a daily post which we just have one this is a pre-order book i got from amazon as you can't tell by the amazon package <laughs> let's get to it uh, hey, Oof. Yeah. So the book i have is dark restraint by katie roberts this is the next book in a series of the neon gods i do have um so this is <laughs> Three, four, five. So this is book seven on the series, and um, I think like that. So I'm really excited to read this. So he was my savior, my monster, my obsession, my destruction. Oof, these are gonna be some names are gonna be hard to pronounce, aren't they? Uh, Adrienian Vitalis is in trouble. She betrayed her father, and he's dangerous but ineffective. Now she's left to rely on Olympia's Christian mercy, mercy, but in this city, mercy comes with a price for her. That means sham marriage to Dionysus. Dion, Dion sus, sus. Okay, <laughs> a man she just has fears, just um, a man she fears just as much as she she desires. The Minotaur never had any illusions about Mino's place. He was willing to get his hands dirty as long as the old man kept his word. At the end of their bloody work, the Minotaur would give her an aria as a reward she meant for him, and he tends to have her no matter the cost. Oof. Ooh. Okay, so these are comes about to show you. They're from source books and they look really nice. So they're from source books. So you have obviously Radiant Sin, The Cruel, Sed Seduction, and Midnight Rain. Rain. They look nice, but I do like these covers as well. So now it tells me the back is gonna be The first thing on this. Oh, I just opened that up and uh, I just saw that. Mmm, pretty. Um, it's signed by the author. Did not, did not see that. Okay. There's a lot of things going on. This is the first sentence. My father gave me strict, strict instructions to stay in the house of on this afternoon of blood and death. And I will be listening to most of these books actually on Audible. So. On that note, we're going to go through the stuff we have. Um, we are waiting on our Lit J Crate order, which is the Tessa Bailey books. Um, same with Fairy Loot, we have the Berlinger Sister series, which is also Tessa Bailey. I like the first bit, My Killer Vacation, by her, and so I was like, you know what, I need the rest of the series. There is like if and ours, but you know what, I don't care, I want them. Then we have the Dark Strange, which we just got received, so woohoo, I can mark that off. Mm. That could say bye bye. Then, oh, that reminds me, I need to put another book on here, which we'll get to at the end. Right, there. Then we have When the Hearts Cut by Kiki, that is by Fairy Loot, and I believe that's coming. I don't know actually. Um, you know what? Make this video just a little bit longer. I'm gonna go on Fairy Loot. And I'm going to check. Might as well, really. Um, if I can find it, you got to bear with me, guys. But you know what? It takes time to do things. I'm sunk it down. Um, aha, here we go. So this book is coming out on... It will ship around between September and October. So I'm going to put that down. Oh my god, I forgot about the book. Hang on. So October time. So I literally just went past the book and I've just learned. And that is Beneath These Stars by Lexi Wyan. I have pre-ordered that book as well. I'm going to just bend down a bit. So that book is going to be shipping out September and October as well. So there might be a few books next month then. So that's going to be quite a few books. Then we have the Jay Wilder set by Fake Crate, so I do wonder when that's going to be arriving. Um, because obviously I have ordered it already, but I just don't know when it's going to be arriving. 
So I think that will be a complete surprise when I get an email saying it's been shipped or something and I get a tracking info or something like that. And then that happens. So we will see. Then obviously we are obviously waiting on our Fair Loot YA box and our Fair Loot Romanticive book box. So the Romanticive book box will become the first. Um, so that should he be even here next week. Maybe. Then obviously the book I just written wrote down was Wisteria by Fair Loot. This is by Adeline Grace. Um, sorry, I'm trying to find the bloody thing. Oh, okay, let me just go to my email. This will be shipped with November and December. Oof, that's so long. I've only got a few books left to go before, like uh, a few piles left before I start rereading. Uh, sorry, before I start reading my new books and new uh, new book stuff to read, uh, new stuff to watch. So anything that come, doesn't come after the time I start reading these, that's on my shelf with backwards ones. Then they start a new shit. They start a new pile, and I have to read those. So if Adeline, um Wisteria doesn't get here by time, obviously I've read through those, watched those and whatever, then obviously that goes from the next one, so which by the looks of it, it will probably be my next list of going through. Um, on that note as well, just going to go on back on to Fairy Loot, um, I have planned, I do plan to um, pre-order The Ghost Smith by Nikki Pearl Petro, which is the second book to The Bone Smith. So that will be coming out on the 29th of August, so end of this month. And that will be shipped between November and December as well. So I will not be able to read that. Um, they did announce Mirror the Beast by Alexandra Birkin and Drown in the Deep by The Dreams by Gabby Burton. But I did get rid of those two books. Um, they announced uh, Fileless Things by Chloe Gong as well. I've never read the book. They announced the two books by Lucy Scott. I've never read anything by Lucy Scott, but I'm still quite intrigued whether I should get it or not. Um, this will an early access coming out on the 22nd of October anyway, so we'll find out more about that. Uh, they're doing the... There's lots of different books that I want to get. But it's hard to get books that I want. And also they've just announced loads of other books, um, their themes for September, and some of their books do look interesting. Um, but you know, um, that is everything I have at the moment that's coming and arriving on the way. Um, also, so you guys know a little heads up. Um, if you're wondering as well, I am working with Bookspace PR and Jessie Dean. So those I will be getting arcs for and everything like that. So I'm currently reading an arc already with by um, Bookspace PR, which is The Keeper by P.S. Weistock. And so far, I have some things. Um, yeah, so if you want to see my review, I will be. It should be up either today or tomorrow, depends when I get it finished. Um, so, because obviously the thing, the clip will be off by the eighth, so I've got really by today or tomorrow to get it all done and read and up. So, I'm gonna put my review on the Goodreads. So, uh, just check me out on Goodreads. It should be here somewhere on the link. If not, just search my emails. Uh, search my Instagram. It's somewhere there, it's just hard to difficult, or I will put it out on my Instagram anyway, what I thought about it too. Um, so I'm about half, just over halfway the book, about 60%, 64% maybe, of that book. Then after that, <laughs> ouch, I will be, it's not basically an arc yet, but it is a, kind of a read to Jesse Dean's book 2 book. But um, it's just to see what our thoughts are of the book and see if we like it, see if he can make any changes and stuff like that. So that is what I'm also working with Jessie Dean as well. If you're not seen on Instagram, um, I am now part of their team, of their street team, which I really, really can't not believe that as well. So I'm really excited too. So there's a lot of things happening, a lot of things changing and slowly but surely I want to move on and get some stuff done as well. Um, so don't worry guys, I do plan to get more back into the animes as well. Oh, look at this. So I am trying to find some mystery boxes and stuff like that as well to come and close to. Alright, so that is everything I have for my daily post for today. I don't think I'll be getting anything at all for the rest of this week or next week maybe. I might get something, maybe by Fairloo, but that's about it. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Bye.